I went to one of the most unique bars in the world. I think it has everything. Really nice location, super awesome view, very creative cocktails, and I think it's one of the places where people go who wants to just get an experience, try something completely different and new. So check it out. Yeah, so we have our own fridge space and then we have our own freezer space as well. All your batches, all your ice, so it's, it's water, very efficient. The water drains out once it reaches a certain point, so it's consistently clean. We have frozen glassware, so each station has its own glassware set to where it needs to be. Right? But it's cool, it means that like we're like very in control of where, where everything's going. Take the temperature of the liquid down to negative 18 so we can really like control the temperature of the product. And it's, uh, it's infused with nitro, so it's going to start to cascade like a Guinness. This is um, overhaul rye, so this predates Prohibition, mm -hmm. which is amazing from 1908, so it's pretty special. This one, this is Bacardi from 1920, so before it moved from Cuba to Puerto Rico. We decided to put some black truffle. So <laughs> it's got 50 grams of black truffle. Uh, yeah. 30 year old. Um, and you can see this, we're coming towards the end, but it's 50 grams of white truffle. Strawberry, orange and lemon. Mm -hmm. okay. And then the idea is we pour the Pim's cup over, so the Pim's cup itself is slow gin with some ginger, some Pim's and some green tea. This one's super cool, so this is called In The Rocks, and it's sort of, I guess in America you have like a whiskey on the rocks. Here the idea was like, let's make it in the rocks, so let's do it inside the, the sphere ice. We got these designed for us by a designer called Martin Kastner. So the idea is that you're going to open the slingshot, pick it up and then let it <laughs> piece. It's fun. Yeah. 